to create a single joint, to create a single joint, we are going to go down to our trays and we're going to go to our pose tools tray. We're going to click on single joint. We're going to position the joint roughly where we want it, in this case the elbow. I'm going to click that step one. And step two is I'm going to drag down. So I'm going to drag towards the wrist or fingertips. And as I drag, you'll see that I get a green arrow showing up. All right, I want to point that arrow to the direction I want things affected. Then I'm going to let go. I've just created a joint at the wrist at this point. A couple things to know. When we place that joint in there, Mudbox puts that joint in the center of the volume. We can change this later on. We can adjust where that pivot is. Um, so, and also, when we picked and dragged it down, you can see that as we drag it down, we get a amount of green. This green is the amount of transition region. So the more green we get, the more is going to transition. We get, if we only drag it a short ways away down, we get a short amount of transition. So let's just take a look here a little closer here. We're just going to go and put one in the neck. And so where I'm going to go and create joint, I'm going to place it in the neck. Now this green line here is my joint boundary ring. And I want to place this so that it cuts across my object like so. Not like that. I want that joint, joint uh, boundary ring to cut across the model. And then I want to drag this green arrow. So if I only drag it a little bit, only a little bit around the tor top torso by his neck will be affected when we go to pose him or alter him. If we bring it way down, all the way down to his chest will bend. So it's how much you want to bend with his neck. I'm just going to do a little bit here. I let go, and you see I get this green area. So the green area, the, the, the brighter the green, the more it's going to be affected by the transition when we go to, to change or pose uh, the model. So, so this is known that arrow down is my weighting vector, and the green is my weight. Okay, the greener the weight, the more it will change. The lighter the green, the less it will change. So we have just placed a single joint, one in his neck and one in his elbow.